I'm Daniel Joseph. I'm an illusion development principal at Walt Disney Imagineering. As a kid, I always found myself trying to take things apart. It was always kind of in the search of figuring out how things worked. Then the best part was taking them apart and making something completely new from them. And then I found uh, a huge love of Halloween and haunted houses and, and making Halloween displays at our house growing up. But then as I got a little bit older and by age 11 they became a little more complex and learned about you know, how to make fog machines and how to do robotics and how to do all these different things just by tinkering and playing. My journey to Imagineering started uh, in college when I finally decided to uh, apply for the Disney Imaginations design competition. And I couldn't believe it in the end, I actually won the competition first place. So I moved out to California and started at a six month internship at Walt Disney Imagineering Research and Development, which ultimately turned into 16 years and I'm still here today. One of my favorite projects to work on uh, was the Hatbox Ghost at the Haunted Mansion at Disneyland in California. And that was just such a dream and so cool because it wasn't really a project anyone had asked for. And myself and a few other folks made a, a very crude mock-up and brought it in and pitched it to executives who were so excited and loved that they made it a real project for us. On top of that, it's, it's a kind of a tribute to one of my childhood idols, Yale Gracie. So to be able to do it and do it in a way that came out uh, in a nice, a nice working way. 50 years after um, he had tried doing it was, was amazing. I moved to Florida about seven years ago. The great thing is that there's, there's a large Imagineering presence here in Florida and that's been amazing because there's been a lot of patents and inventions that we've gotten to come up with over the years uh, right here in Florida. I have to say the induction into the Florida Inventors Hall of Fame is absolutely incredible and caught me off guard in every way. I was so surprised. I've been an inventor all my life. I love what I do and I, I have always loved what I do and I've had a passion for it. But to be recognized for it, to be placed among people uh, of such stature is incredible. And um, I, I am very, very humbled by it. I'd love to thank everyone in the Florida Inventors Hall of Fame uh, for considering me and really delving into my work and, and appreciating this, this little side of innovation. Um, it really means a lot. Thank you.